Meghan Markle's recent episode featured Deepika Padukone, and fans of the Bollywood actress are going gaga over this collaboration. In the podcast, Deepika puts rumours of her separation with Ranveer Singh to rest, and talks about a mental health journey with Meghan, who shares her story on the issue too. However, fans of Deepika Padukone have pointed out how a few sentences spoken by Meghan are offensive towards Deepika. Reading off a script they found online, they felt Meghan was condescending towards the Indian actress, and this set off a huge debate on Reddit. Deepika Padukone's appearance on Meghan Markle's podcast sparked a discussion on mental health, how it is perceived by the general public, and how a strong support system can make all the difference in the world. While introducing Deepika to her archetype's listeners, Meghan said, This is Deepika Padukone, actress, model, and activist. And though she may not be a household name all over the world, she's one of the most famous actresses in all of Bollywood. Some took offence to how she didn't find Deepika important enough to be labelled as a household name, despite being the brand ambassador for international brands like Cartier and L'Oreal and Louis Vuitton. Many thought this gave away Meghan Markle's inherent arrogance and made Deepika Padukone appear like an upcoming celebrity, whereas she's already on top of the game. Clearly, Meghan wants to undermine her. One Reddit user said, I think Meghan Markle feels the need to subtly put down her guests because she will never be able to match their accomplishments on her own right. Nothing she's achieved even scratches the surface of the achievements of her guests. Not one. The second added, She's more consistent with putting other women down and being bitchy than acting like the feminist she said she is. Disgusting. Meghan Markle isn't a household name either, and that sentence ends there. At least Deepika is legitimately famous in a huge market. Another mocked, have you seen Deepika's face? She's stunningly beautiful. She's a huge star in Bollywood movies. She's also very talented. Is she not a face of L'Oreal? Yeah, old Megzi can only hope to achieve 100th of her success. Needless to say, Meghan Markle has been put on blast for the eye-rolling podcast filled with whinging and moaning. These claims have been made by royal correspondent Rupert Bell and Talk TV's Julia Hartley Brewer. Miss Hartley Brewer started it all off by saying, she's whinging and moaning again. There are these stereotypes, and I do accept that, but she's talking about how she's been called these things and isn't that terrible. Hasn't she been called these things because of what she's said and what she's done, rather than because she's a woman? But Mr. Bell, on the other hand, added, another eye-rolling moment from me there, Julia. I have to say, it's this Californian culture where everything has to be analysed. You've got to see a therapist. Why can't people sometimes take a look at themselves when they haven't got a problem? I'm not sure Megan has got huge problems because she's living in a million dollar house and she's extremely comfortable. But before concluding, he added, but it's the woe is me feeling that she always wants to create. She doesn't sound happy. Megan has called out Hollywood for negative stereotypes. She's doing this on purpose. Hollywood rejected her hard and when they did it pre-suits, she could explain it away no exposure. Now she can't do that and she's pissed. We know that she has to burn every town that rejects her to the ground. 